Hello again and welcome to Toolbox Talk Friday. This week we are going to talk about the humble light switch. First, no conversation about light switches would be complete unless we talked about stab in the back connections. If you look at a light switch and you see that there are holes in the back of it designed for wires to stick straight into the back of it and use little pinchy connections, they grasp onto them like that. Those are going to be lower end, low grade switches. You can usually see this by looking in the junction box or pulling off a cover plate. If you see wiring wrapped around the screws, they're not stabbing the back. If you see wires poked right into the back of the switch, that tells us we've got a prone to failure situation or you've had a lower end electrical contractor doing your work. So let's talk about a couple simple ways you can identify issues that you might have with switches in your place of business or in your residence. All switches were originally referred to as snap switches. So you're looking for a crisp, clean snap. So when you turn the device off and on, you should feel and see a crisp, clean snap. Just ask yourself the question, is it snappy? If it's not, you know that you have got lower end switches or they're prone to failure. Secondly, we're looking to see if that switch actually stops halfway in between or doesn't snap at all. Sometimes on lower end switches, or on old switches that have been gummed up or gotten old, you physically have to push them all the way through the throw or they get stuck in the middle. That is a really bad situation, can lead to sparking and micro arcing and cause uh, fires. So if you have switches that aren't firmly shutting off and on, that is a situation we know we need to correct. Another quick way to determine if you've got a potential issue with a switch is to physically go up to the device with the cover plate on and just put your hand on it and feel if it's too hot. A lot of times you can even feel it through the screws that mount the cover plate to the switch or on the whole wall section right there. Heat is an indication, especially excessive heat, of a potential failure point, either a bad connection or a bad switch. So if you feel something that is unnaturally hot, you know that that is a potential failure point with your switch. So let's remember, we want switches that are snappy, not sloppy. Thanks for joining us today. If you have questions about switches, give us a call here at Artisan Electric.